Pinya is not a town that can be visited in a single day. It is a place for fine palates. Here, as far back as the Middle Ages, they allowed themselves the luxury of having a fully covered square that welcomes you when you arrive. This square testifies to an important past. In the Middle Ages, Pinya was a transit point for goods coming from the sea towards France, the Duchy of Savoy and Switzerland. One of the most important salt transport routes passed through here. The town was therefore at the center of an ancient web of trade, and this can even be seen in the structure of the Caruggi alleyways, which are much wider than in other towns in the area where they are better known, such as Dolce Acqua. If you want to enter this past, listen to Roberto. The church of San Bernardo was completely frescoed in 1482 by Giovanni Canavesio, and inside you can see an Annunciation, the four evangelists, four doctors of the church. On the walls is the Passion of Christ. In addition to this jewel that we have only touched on here, art in Pigna will give you many other suggestions. But since we want to proceed slowly, we will take you to the House of Aromas. In these rooms, you can get close to the spontaneous plants of the area. In one room, you can use the rocking chairs while enjoying an infusion. In the second, you can read a good book lying on a bed of hay. And in the last room, you can take an aromatic lavender sauna. As another Roberto will tell us, Pigna is right on the slopes of two Dolomites nestled in the Ligurian Alps, the Toraggio and Pietravecchia Mounds, which are not only spectacular, but host a unique biodiversity of flora and fauna. The flora has unique endemisms thanks to the climate of peaks that reach 2,000 meters but are only 20 kilometers from the sea. The shy, sexy frage or the arrogant pom-pom lily give way further down the valley to the king of the cuisine of these areas, the white piña bean. This bean has a delicate thin skin and is considered slow food. And speaking of cuisine, insist on having the rare Gran Pistau prepared, an ancient dish that retains the flavor of the early Middle Ages. Stories are told of that period here, such as this final taste of ancient pagan cults and where the Christian church failed to establish settlements or build control sites, it imagined them populated by demons, such as the fountain of the Dragorina, a place far from in the inhabited area and site of ancient pagan cults.